Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley Budek, and today we're going to be doing a glueless lace wig install. So, you guys already know when somebody sets glueless on YouTube, you never know what they mean. Do they mean like glueless, like they use an adhesive, like a, a holding spray, or what do they mean? And for this one, we are 100% glueless so there's no glue there's no gel there's no spritz there's literally nothing holding this one down and as you guys can see i'm gonna go ahead and add my melt belt in just a minute so let it melt and marry while i chill out and wait for pilates but in the meantime in between time it literally is absolutely glueless and it's a frontal like it's glueless in a frontal that is absolutely amazing this one did come from rpg show i do have it linked in the description box so without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into the video okay babies let's get it i am in this gym wig looking fried dyed laid to the side i went ahead and did a little bit of self-care before we started them elbows and them little knuckles were super ashy you know little grooves in between your hand Jo Malone has been my favorite, and so I went ahead and put a little bit on, and then I put on some perfume. My husband thinks I'm weird, but a lot of the times when I film, I'll put perfume on. It just makes me feel the vibe, and this one here smells so good. These are not sponsored. These are just things I'm into, so yeah, I'll let you guys know what these are in the description box. I also have to have a fresh cup of coffee. I've been making my own coffee at home lately, so yay me, but this is the star of the show here. She's absolutely gorgeous, and we are doing a glueless install she's 18 inches in length she's a 13 by 6 glueless lace front wig 200 percent density here's a look at the inside construction of the cap and you know rpg show has you covered they did include this adjustable elastic band this is going to add a little bit of extra comfort for your wig before we install let's go ahead and moisturize our own hair i've been using the myel drops and i have been loving the way my hairline has been growing in a lot more lately that paired with taking my own hair vitamins has definitely helped the hairline so let's go ahead and install this one i like to put the elastic band on first and then the wig right after here is a look at what she looks like on and I love the colorway on this one as I mentioned she's 18 inches in length and she came pre-colored pre-curled bust down middle part the knots are bleached the color I don't know who did this color dye job but it's so professional it's nice and gradient and healthy this one also comes in a natural brown and I believe it also comes in a jet black there's also three different uh, length options as well so you can definitely customize yours look at how beautiful and seamless the hairline is and we haven't even cut the lace off 100% guarantee you don't need to customize anything on this one so we're going to start off by cutting off the excess lace you guys know I like to pay attention to detail and make sure I cut the excess lace around the ear now sometimes if your head is a little bit smaller you will cut the excess lace around the ear and you'll actually have to cut off like lace that has hair attached never be afraid of that that is important to make sure your wig gets custom here is a close-up of the hairline as I mentioned she's pre-plugged to perfect perfection the lace is perfection i haven't tinted anything and literally i just feel so confident with this one so i'm going to use these scissors and i did receive this from rpg show many many maybe months ago maybe even many years ago and these happen to be my favorite scissors they came in one of the goodie bags they sent to me and so you can see i cut off half the lace and it's literally like what lace like it blends and melts so amazing so first I cut off the excess lace and I left those ear tabs so you can see what that would look like. For me in my head shape I felt like adding leaving too much lace around the ears was going to require me to bond it down. So I did go back in and cut off a little bit more lace near the uh, ear and the sideburn and you'll see on this side I'm kind of slowing it down. I cut off cut off and I like to like make it a little bit jagged and then I cut upward so that I can again have no ear taps so that we don't have to bond anything down and so now you can see how melted it is and we haven't even added any lace tint or anything like that so you guys see I'm happy I'm in a good mood but we do want to make it look extra laid. We want to look like we came out the salon. So we're going to go in with my personal favorite, which is the Dynamic Duo. This is the wax stick paired with the electric hot comb. I like to go in generously with my wax. But if you don't want too much product, you can definitely um, 
hold out or you know just be a little bit more light-handed and as you guys can see I apply it to the area I did work it in with a comb off camera and then we go in with the electric hot comb and this one goes up to 500 degrees and I definitely do use it on 500 degrees and I don't know if you guys can like rewind and look at that but you can see the difference in how like sleek it looked it already looked melted but now it looks like sleek and salon ready I'm going to go behind that and just tint the lace to perfection. And I am using a uh, Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, which is super uh, affordable. And I'm sure you have it at your local grocery store or Target. I'll have it linked in the description box of where I get mine. Here, it kind of looked a little bit too dark at some points, but then also like perfect at some points. You just have to like be careful and find something that matches perfectly. Now I'm going to go in and make the sideburns match. My sideburns, of course, are a natural kinky texture, but you guys can see when I use my edge control, it literally like brings everything together. Again, you have the option to leave a little bit more lace around the ear tabs and it definitely will give more like the sideburn look. I didn't want to have any maintenance, so I cut those off and you guys can see how I made it work and still did no baby hair and still kept it glueless. So now I'm going to go ahead and work on the parting space. This one did come with a beautiful six inches of parting going back. So I'm going to go ahead with the wax paired with the electric hot comb once more to, and look, I was just so, so, so in love, speechless about how beautiful this is. But I did go in to flatten out the parting. This is essential to make it really, really, really look sleek. And this is a before and after. This side is puffy and then the other side is super flat. So we're going to make the opposite side match up. Now, some key points about this one is that the wig is glueless. We have the new invisible knots and real scalp. It's upgraded pre-plucked hairline. And then, of course, you have free parting. So you can make it a side part, no part, center part, a shorter part, a longer part, literally a curved part, D part, C part, whatever you want. Here I am cleaning up the parting and perfecting it to my liking. I love the Fenty Concealer in the color 420 on me. So I did add that on top and then I buffed it out just so that it's not just sitting there. It kind of blends in a little bit better. I did take my time on this one and I made sure not to like mess with the ends until I was ready to uh, be done because I didn't want to have to curl it. I really wanted to utilize the work they did for me. The work is done for you, so why do more? You can definitely go in and curl it more but I loved it as is I just used a wide tooth comb to uh, pull out the curls and kind of just marry everything I did add a little bit of oil sheen be careful with this because it is oil but I do love 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 the way it came out absolutely beautiful and it still remains 100% glueless all details are in the description box and yeah I'm going to show you the unboxing and all of that but thank you for sticking around with your girl okay ladies so we are done with the look look at the bounce look at the curl look at the color Look at the texture. Look at the fit. And look how it is glueless. And you can see <laughs> my concealer there and the line for my makeup. But you can also see that we don't have anything bonded down. This is a frontal and from ear to ear it fits glueless. Which if you guys know, of course, you can get a closure wig that's going to fit glueless. That's easy. But having a frontal that fits glueless from ear to ear is absolutely, absolutely a gem and a bonus. So this is why I love RPG Show is because I'm always able to get a glueless wig that fits me glueless and does what it's supposed to do. So you guys already know that typically we get a good dust bag. I would love to know how many dust bags I've had from them and counting because they always give a really nice good, ba good dust bag and I love the fact that I'm able to keep my wigs in there. And then this is the box, which I think I have it upside down. Yes. Nice, sturdy packaging. Tissue paper does say RPG show and then like this is their logo and stuff there. So you are definitely getting custom uh, packaging. This here is the flyaway tamer. And this is like a nice little wax stick. It's anti-fridge, nourishing, and portable. And it's basically, you guys seen I use wax for the Dynamic Duo. This is the same thing, and this is their brand. And it looks like a deodorant. It like rolls up and rolls down like a deodorant. It's super cute, and it's small and portable, so you can keep it in your purse. It's a great size, and again, it cancels out all that frizz, and it'll lay the hair down super flat. And then they also gave me a nice 
brown like me pair of uh wig caps they also gave me their magazine what company you know got their own magazine i'll wait and then last but not least they also gave me this here and if you guys know i love these this is just such a bougie addition and this is basically storage for your wig so it zips up and down and you definitely can just like put your wig here and store it and like how beautiful and how bougie like when you're around others like when you pull up for your hair appointment if you're someone who like gets your wigs installed take this like put your wig into this and then take it with you so that you can tell your stylist like here install this and it's just so cute and fabulous and bougie i love that for me as far as the wig goes you guys seen i kind of zoomed you guys in and focused a lot on the hairline today i wanted you guys to see how amazing their work is you don't have to pluck or twist anything out you can literally cut the lace put her on and go i did show you guys how like i take it a step further and just make it look super super fire and i think i executed this one very well i love this for me i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go be sure to check this wig out i have a direct link in the description box also there you'll find like all of the specs on mine because you will be able to um like custom yours to your liking when you get to the site thank you guys so much for watching also don't forget to check the description box for lists and links of everything we used to complete this look and subscribe if you haven't already and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches